So this was taken from the ISS, the International Space Station, which, by the way, is home to 11 different space agencies. It's not just NASA. So this, so, you know, NASA astronauts are under NDAs, non-disclosure agreements, and they're really not allowed to do this. But this is not, this was an astronaut from Spain who was part of the ESA, the European Space Agency. And he watched this ship, okay, and we've seen it return since then, in May and June of 2022. For two months, this craft hovered above the Earth, and it had little scout ships coming and going. Okay, so if you see here, this all these little dots around it and this little like elongated thing at the bottom of it, they are, these are ships that are coming and going in and out of it and changing the lighting. Mm. So the light is, is getting bright and then it's getting dull and then it's, but it's still, it, this was stationary for two months. So this astronaut just like, he's watching this out the window from the ISS and he's like, you know, and this is what happens to a lot of humans where they're seeing this stuff. They're not supposed to talk about it, but they feel the humanity takes over and they got out his cell phone and he and he recorded it and, uh, you know, put it on the Internet. And and once that genie's out of the bottle, it's not going back because everybody copies it. It ends up on all these different yeah. YouTube channels. And well, here it is. So so we know and I just put it here that, you know, because people were, you know, the, all, all of the science fiction movies give us something to uh, relate to. So people said, oh, it looks like the Klingon bird of prey. So it kind of stuck. Um, I'm sorry, the video isn't working very well, but I'll just like go through this so you could see. So you could see he's at the top of the earth. He's looking at it. He sees the auroras. It gets a little clear. That's kind of a pretty good clarity. Yeah. Um, An unusual shape. Yes. And we've seen it. We see it. Uh, it, it showed up again um, recently. 